What's up, guys? Today we're watching Ratatouille. And if you guys want to be a rat, get this video to 20,000 likes. And if you want to listen to the full commentary, it's over on our Patreon, where we're currently doing an exclusive reaction to Avatar and Total Drama Revenge for the Island. I, on the other hand, take cooking seriously. That's the guy who eats the food, and then he's like, oh, I ate the food. It reminds me of my childhood. He definitely said that instead of, like, showing it in the movie. Like, he definitely said that sentence verbatim. This reminds me of the food that I ate when I was a child. You've helped a no Noble cause. Noble? We're, we're thieves, Dad. Has Remy canonically read the Bible? And God says thieves are wrong. Thou shalt not steal. He's like very extremely religious. That would be really funny. Do you think with like how like science is evolving, the fact that we can like manipulate the brain chemistry of these rats, do you think we could train rats to do like agriculture so that they don't eat our food anymore? Like the, they become self-sufficient? <laughs> that would be so cool. We have like little rat societies in the middle of our gardens. And something new was created. I'm hungry. Don't worry, I had like four saltine crackers this morning. Like, I don't even care. <laughs> That's not even a joke. This is my this is my breakfast right here. That's better than fing cheese and strawberries. That sounds fing terrible, I'm not gonna lie. Tom de Chevre de Pay! That would go beautifully with my mushroom! It definitely is not pronounced like that. Yes, it is, bro. Tom de Chevre de Pays. He's a rat, man. You gotta give him some leeway. You think his French pronunciation is perfect? What are these American rats doing in France in the first place? Shouldn't, shouldn't they have f***ing French accents? Shouldn't they be saying wee oui, wee oui and shit? I don't like secrets. All this cooking and, 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 and reading. Is the rat's name Ratatouille? Yep. The rat's name isn't Ratatouille. The guy's name isn't Ratatouille. There's no Ratatouille in the movie. They just thought, oh, rat, funny, but that's like offensive. Because it's beautiful. Because it's like the main character of the movie isn't Remy or Linguini, but the food. Oh my God, the food we've made along the day. Only the fearless can be great. The guy's head is an eggplant. It's fucking gorgeous. He looks like what he cooks. And now she's gonna find out that she has a rat infestation, which is going to lead her to call an exterminator. No, nope. she has a shotgun. She has a shotgun. Never mind. Who gave this senile old lady a gun, bro? That is fucking disgusting. Is the insurance gonna cover that? People didn't have insurance back in the day. <laughs> back in the day, you had a shotgun, not insurance. What is wrong with this old lady? The rats have left your house. They are evacuating. She just destroyed her entire house. She's on a vengeful mission right now. This is spite. She is mentally ill. So how does he end up in Paris? Like, does the entire country's drainage system just put all the shit in Paris? Is that why it smells so bad or something? Like, what? Well, he meets two, like, young, like, up-and-coming rappers. And they kind of help him make it, make it to the big time. Yo, Remy. I've just lost my family. All my friends. Your family fucking hated you, though. Let's be honest. Like, your dad was a piece of shit. Your brother was stupid. Like, you're better than them. Like, abandon them and move on. What's wrong with being stupid? Sorry, man. You're doing great. I need The worst part about this is that they're not constantly swearing. Like, it kind of breaks my immersion. Where's all the screaming? Like, Gordon Ramsay needs to tell Linguini to kill himself. You're making me mad! So nice of you to visit. I was, uh, my mother. Linguini is actually voiced by one of the artists at Pixar. Like, he's not like a voice actor, voice actor, isn't he? I don't know. He's the teacher in Incredibles, also. Linguini is voiced by TJ Miller? Oh, cool. You. Dude, that guy's face is concaved in. Did he get hit by a frying pan when he was a kid? That's just what French people look like. <laughs> I just love how like dense and long all the shots are. It really feels like you're on like a rat amusement park ride. It feels like I'm on the Epcot Remy coaster right now. There is a Ratatouille ride at Epcot. That's why I referenced it. Be quiet, Corn. You should feel bad about yourself too. There's like too many ingredients in this too. Like, what is he doing right now? He's just only using four ingredients. He just keeps like pizzazzing it, but it's just the same ingredient. You put thyme, basil, like, I don't know. No! Is this the scene where the guy tastes the soup and then it brings him back? No. So when does the guy taste the soup and it brings him back? Is that at the end of the movie? That's kind of like the climactic scene of like the whole movie. The Claire. What did she say? She likes a soup. It's very strange that everybody in this movie has a French accent except for the rat. <laughs> the rat has an American voice. Everybody else has this French accent. What belief is that, Mademoiselle Tattoo? Anyone can cook. Damn, she is fucking sticking her, her nose out for this motherfucker, bro. Well, that's just a general activity for her. She's a queen for this. 
What should I do now? Kill it. Now? No, they jarred him. Oh my god. No. no. A minute. Put your Alfredo sauce inside of that jar, linguini. Dude, this motherfucker always ends up in the river. Like, just drown already. Like, you're gonna drop in the river without even in it first. He's such a soft boy. Did you not? Have. Have you been nodding? Like, I'm not gonna lie, like, some rats are absolutely adorable, but some rats are disgusting. You don't gotta lie for the viewers, bro. It's okay. Like, look at this. He's so cute. Kill that fucking motherfucker. Oh my god. What did I expect? That's what I get for trusting a rat. He's cooking you some fucking bangered breakfast, bro. Jesus. Okay, so, like, I know that Linguini has, like, a romance dress in this movie, but, like, Remy is just giving, like, proper boyfriend material. So true. You know. They did it! They did it! Show fuck, Linguini. Show us your fucking Linguini. Oh, it's so cute. They're playful. They're like biting each other and shit. It's so it's so cute. It's like, oh, where'd you get these hickeys from? Oh yeah, my my rat did this. Is his hair like connected to his brain? Dude, he's balding after this, let's be honest. He's ripping out his fucking hair every day. Dude, if he goes bald, his career is over. Yeah, dude, it's done. One look and I knew. We had the same crazy idea. <laughs> no fucking way he just said that. We had the same idea. Oh, Linguini. Oh, Remy. Oh. Do you think the guinea pig can control Eminem when it goes up his ass? Well, that's how he raps so fast because he's trying to get the guinea pig out of there. Anybody who's good at anything has the guinea pig up their butt. What? <laughs> he didn't go down to make sure everyone was safe. He has no care for their well-being whatsoever. He's a rat, dude. I just want you to know how honored I am to be studying under such a good... No, you listen. She is fucking terrifying. She's awesome. I'm like the Lego Batman gif right now, dude. She's the kind of girl that'll chop your dick off. Oh wait, this is the meme. Oh my god. What is he reading though? What is on that page? I didn't even know this was from Ratatouille. I've never seen that before in context. He's not Gusto's son. Gusto had no children. Ah, uh, Gusto was a virgin. He could not get his d out. He was too fat. Anyone can cook, but not anyone can f A job for the boy. Only a job. Well. Oh, DNA test. I just took a DNA test. Oh my god. Oh, 23 and me. But then he's gonna do run the DNA and he's gonna find out that he's not even human. He's a rat. He's a human rat hybrid. Ugh, your sleeves look like you threw up on them. It's kind of strange that they chose her to be the one that like does this because she was very nice and supportive immediately for him. And now she's like busting his balls. Like she's kicking him in the balls. I wish. The rat. <laughs> There's multiple levels of like people thinking they're crazy in this. One guy's talking to a rat, one guy's talking to a ghost. He thinks he sees a rat, but then he's making him think he's crazy. If it's linguini they want, tell them Chef Linguini has prepared something special. Jesus. What an asshole, dude. He's giving him an opportunity. What are you talking about, Jack? He believes in him. What is the lifespan of a rat? Like, I'm starting to think this just isn't a sustainable strategy. Three to five years should be fucking shorter, in my opinion. He was acting so normally before this, and now he's just being the goofiest MF in the kitchen. Like, he was so normal. I think I'd be calling for an exorcism in this kitchen at this point. Sorry. <laughs> I like how Remy's so smug. Yeah, Remy's kind of like a snarky bitch. What a fucking asshole. He was not like this before. That rat sure can cook. Damn, I love rats. I would eat a whole thing about rats. Dude, can you imagine Ice Spice rapping over this though? She should sample this so hard. Like that boy is a cast. Say yeah, he home, but I know where he at. What a petty bitch. Your restaurant is succeeding. Like you're making money off of this. But he wants to sell out. He wants to make even more money by selling the image of the of the restaurant. Wow, so great. Truly really everyone's greatest dream. A meal? Oh. I can't believe it. Why? Me and bro when we end up in Paris. Oh my god. Do you feel like it's culturally motivated that the rats sound like New Yorkers in the city of Paris? Is that what French people think of, think of America? <laughs> that 
Chew it slowly. Mm. Only think about the mm. taste. Gee, he's so pretentious. Fucking Remy, shut up. Let him eat, man. He's hungry. Let him eat his fucking garbage, man. He's a rat. What do you have to more than family? What's more important here? Well... Oh, my God. Bro thinks he's Vin Diesel. <laughs> You're not Vin Diesel. Remy has not watched Fast and the Furious. Sounds like rat and patootie. Rat patootie. I think this is the scene I figured out what ratatouille was. Because I think as a kid, I thought his, the rat's name was ratatouille until this point. This, this feels like they were writing down the monologue. Like the executives being like, why the fuck do you want to call this movie ratatouille? That doesn't make any sense. Why would they say that though? Like it's so obvious. I don't understand how anyone could not know that. On tonight, huh? Rats. All we do is take, dad. I'm tired of taking. I want to make things. I want to- This is a Remy is gay moment, by the way. Yeah, I was to say do you think this is kind of like an lgbtq allegory like coming out to your family almost that's what a lot of people see it as that's the beauty of very vague theming is that you can apply it to anything and feel good about yourself are you telling me this rat is gay we must live carefully Segregation against rats is crazy. I would say this is a little bit a step farther than what the definition of segregation is. Yeah, fucking teach me segregation after the, yeah, you should do that to me. You can't change nature. Change is nature. Conservative father versus liberal son. A tale as old as time. Your son might be gay. Let him suck the c gay son or thought dot. Whoa. <laughs> It's insane how powerful Linguini's hair is. Like, it completely controls all of his bodily functions. It's so cool. Do you think I could make you react on command if I pulled on your chest hair? Whoa! Sick joke! 9-11 joke? I have, like, default programming. It's when your girlfriend finds that you're gay. Like, what did you just say? <laughs> you speaking from personal experience or something? What did he say? What a fucking d dude! He just looks like he's like he's coming into work like high. He's wearing the sunglasses. Uh, a little, a little, <laughs> little. <laughs> Bro, put Nathan Fielder on the screen. <laughs> a tiny shot. That's what he calls it. Huh. <gasps> this is such a weird scene. She has pepper spray in her hand. This is strange. I I don't know how to feel about this. What the fuck is this sexual? Assault? Well, I truly don't know. Gusto has finally found his rightful place in history. This is us reacting to anything. They're kind of mid and they, I don't know. We should start writing dissertations after we finish a series. This is weird. I don't know. This is like... It's literally a polyamorous relationship. It's a polyamorous relationship and she doesn't know. Well, that's what it's like to date a girl who has a rat, you know? Remy dies. Nah, dude, he got a girlfriend and all of a sudden he forgot about his bros. Bro, this is just every homie. Oh, entire clan's gonna be after me with their mouths open and up. Oh, here it is. This is the one kind of weird part. They really hammer home this like stealing is bad theme, but like he's a rat. Like he, he's not a part of society. He is actively oppressed and they actively try to kill him on a regular basis. But being a rat is wrong and being a human is good. Oh, it's like being gay is wrong. How are you reading this cursive ass language? I can't read cursive. Dude, this is just like the scene from the Lizzie McGuire movie, bro. Oh my God, when they're on the Vespas, this is crazy. This is just like the scene where an old man dies in a motorcycle accident. I forgot there was a car chase scene in Ratatouille. Like I didn't think that was possible, but they did it. Damn! He got it like that, though. He's a millionaire. The Nepo baby anthem is beautiful. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Like, he didn't have to learn cooking. He didn't have to fucking er make his way up the ladder in the goddamn... He didn't even have to earn his own girlfriend. Yes, Inspector. Whoa, this is the saddest looking man in the universe. Let this man into art school. That's all I'm saying. Let him in. Let him in. I don't. Swallow. He doesn't swallow though. He doesn't swallow. I will spit out your Alfredo sauce linguini. Yo, he's so badass the doors close magically behind him. <laughs> <gasps> the 
flat as the cook. You cool off and get your mind right, little chef. Do you think he wears the chef hat to bed? Yeah, I, th I think there's like a non-zero chance Linguini wears that shit to bed. Doesn't even wash it. Hasn't washed it once since she got it. It didn't seem right to leave things the way that we did. I couldn't please Colette, like, without you. Like, I couldn't kiss like you do. You use so much tongue, man. I, I can't, I can't keep up. This is what it's looking like behind the counter at the Chipotle. How could you? I I thought you were my friend. I trusted you. I trusted you. He switched up in literally two seconds. I wouldn't have anything without you, Rami. I couldn't do anything without you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Kill yourself. Oh, no. What do we do? I'll, I'll, I'll go get that. Dude, his brother has caused, like, every problem in his life. I'm having a rat rat day. It's about time that I get my day. Tell your chef. Linguini that I want whatever he dares to serve me. Why is he gray? He is literally like a different color tone than like the rest of the movie. He's just a walking like bowl of depression. He just looks like a corpse. He looks like the corpse husband from the corpse Bride. I pretend to be a human through Linguini. I, I pretend you exist. I pretend to be straight. I pretend I not to like so Olivia Rodrigo. But I really like the vampire song. I, I like it a lot. Dad! Family finally does one good thing for him in his life. Dude, these rats are powerful. <laughs> Say corner, you fucking asshole. There's no communication in this kitchen. Jack, have you ever worked in a kitchen? No, but I've watched the bear, so I basically worked in a kitchen. So I understand how it works. Look, he's saying, take me. He was literally ready to die. It's like suicide by police, like suicide by chef. Suicide by French people. And this rat, this brilliant, Little chef. He puts him back in his pants. A beautiful little chef. Oh my god. She realized that when he was banging her with the toque on, Remy was doing all the moves. I wondered why you were so much better in bed that one time. Remy is a chef in the bed as well, bro. Anyone can cook. Rats can cook. Fuck off. It's a rat. Wait, anyone can cook? Me when I'm depressed, but then my fat friend shows up and I'm like, fat people are funny. That's his dad. This really means that much to you? I've known you were gay, son. I saw your Spotify rap. Your top 100 songs were all Olivia Rodrigo. What are they gonna do? Like kill him or something? <laughs> this is legitimately terrifying. We need someone to wait tables. What? Where'd he get the roller skates? What are we in fucking Sonic right now? What the fuck? Why does he have roller blades on? Motherfucker thinks he's in card captor Sakura right now. I feel like if this happened in real life, the customers would get so angry, they would just walk in there and beat him to death. <laughs> Why is that one rat so built? They got the rat that's voiced by The Rock in this movie. That's like one of those like rats you see in New York that's like the size of a cat. That's a radioactive rat right there. That's not, that should not be like that. Is that just tomatoes and pickles? It's sliced vegetables. I was gonna say, if it's just tomatoes and pickles, it's gotta be like the most disgusting thing I've heard in my entire life. Oh shit! When mom finds the piss drawer, like, like that's just what he looks like there. He had no chin since he was born, bro. That sucks. No. No. <laughs> he's busting. Look, he's grabbing onto the fucking tape. <laughs> he like bit his lip. You will have to wait until all the other customers have gone. He gets fucked off wine. He's gonna be drunk when he sees the rat, so it's gonna be chill. He's gonna dap up the rat all fucking drunk. He had two bottles of wine. This mother is drunk as hell. Like, look at his, how skinny he is. Like, he should be red in the face. New creations, the new. Oh shit, oh my God, let me fucking watch that. Oh my God. But Remy doesn't get no Has there been a female rat in the entire movie? There's not even been a female rat. I mean, Remy doesn't need a female rat. Well, we had to let Skinner and the health inspector loose. And of course they ratted us out. Ha, <laughs> nice, nice. I'm not like using like a slur though. They ratted us out and he's a rat saying that. Like it's a little fuck. I guess he can reclaim it. Hey, believe me, that story gets better when I tell. This is actually an accurate depiction of Paris though. It's like the most beautiful place, but in all of the walls are just hundreds of rats crawling in between the slithery caverns of the city. I've always wanted to go to Paris, but after that description, I don't I don't think I'm ever gonna go. Like, I'm, I don't know. That sounds fucking disgusting. And this is the part where you guys both take off your hats and there's rats underneath. They've been making us react the whole time. Oh my God. And if you guys want to watch more Pixar movies, get this video 20,000 likes and comment the
them down below. Check out our Patreon for more exclusive content and the uncut version of this video. Thank you guys. Aramir. Alzheimer's is a bad disease. We should cure it. Aaron Tateson. Atomic Leon. Bento. Kam Luke. Cosmic Dega. Crystal Bunny. Frozen Spaghetti. Gabriel Granados. Gurney Snai Jonasson. Hayden H. Helio. Honor Pearson. Hummus. I pegged Brett Hand. Isaiah Alford. Jace LaRue. K99. King of the Streets. Leaf. Lilac Moon. My Artistry. McBally Attic. Native. Okuma. Patrick Case Randolph. Pigeon Witch. Rain. Sam. Terrence Sills. Union Prince Gov. Val Explicit. Victoria. Weebologist Rick. Yvonne Got Too Bored. Z9R.